Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna make a cooking video again. In this, we are gonna try making the simple clay pot chicken rice using a rice cooker and also ABC soup. So let's see what Joshua is preparing now. Hello, so yeah, as Joanne said, we're gonna make these two things. So here are the ingredients, let's check it out. So yeah, uh, for the clay pot chicken rice, we'll be using some chicken. This will be uh, actually the bone chicken thigh, about two chicken thighs. And also for the uh, marination, we'll be using some uh, duck soy sauce, some soy sauce, some uh, oyster sauce, and also a little oil. And for the rice, we'll be using some uh, jasmine rice, but any rice is fine. Uh, together with some mushrooms, some ginger, and uh, garlic. And also, uh, this is totally optional, we'll be using some uh, dry chili. And also, uh, for flavouring, we'll be using some uh, sugar for the sweetener of, of the chicken later on. And also pepper. So for the soup, here are the simple veggies that uh, you need. Basically, it's tomato, potato, uh, onion, carrots, and also corn. So for the base of the soup, we will be just using these simple ingredients which is uh, some anchovies and also some uh, chicken bone. Actually this is, uh, if let's say you buy your chicken thigh with bone, this is actually the, the bone after you debone it. So just keep it so that later on you can uh, flavour the soup more. If you don't have this, it's totally fine because we have tried using anchovies only and it works out great. And for the uh, pepper, we'll be using some uh, white whole pepper, just about one spoonful. So yeah. We try to keep it as simple as possible without any MSG so we will stay healthy. Let's get to it! So for the marination of the chicken, you'll be needing about 1 tablespoon of uh, oyster sauce. We just put it in the container first. And after that, we'll be needing about uh, close to 1 tablespoon of uh, soy sauce. So just a little bit of uh, dark soy sauce, about probably half a tablespoon. The rest we just throw it. Add in the garlic for more flavoring, and also the dry chili. And here comes the chicken. Lastly, we'll put in some uh, pepper. Okay, that'll be enough. And just like that, you can just uh, toss it around. And if let's say you have a container with a lid, what I'm going to do is I'll just close the lid and simply shake it. Okay, so for the marination right now is done. We will have to uh, let it rest and uh, let the chicken to be marinated about at least 30 minutes so that it's flavorful. So we're gonna put this in the fridge and we will cook the rest. Meanwhile, the chicken is uh, marinating in the fridge, we will prepare the ABC soup first. So for that, just preheat your pot and we will pour some uh, oil. This is for the frying of the anchovies so that it's pretty grand for the soup later on. So once the pan is hot, prepare your lid because uh, once I pour the anchovies in, we will close the lid. So let it fry for a while. Okay, so after about like 30 seconds of uh, frying the uh, anchovies, we lift it open, throw in some uh, onion. We will start tossing in the carrots as well. Okay, 
over here, we will pour in about 700 uh, ml of water. Then we'll put all the ingredients in. Make some space for the uh, So we just keep warm while uh, we prepare the uh, clay pot chicken rice. That's all guys. Alright, so once the soup starts boiling, uh, we will put in some soy sauce. You can put salt if you want, but uh, I feel like soy sauce will make it more fragrant. And add to your likings for us, I think we will need about 2 tablespoons. Just keep it warm, meanwhile waiting for the chicken and rice. So right now we are gonna make the clay pot chicken rice. First we'll wash the rice and then we'll pour the stock in. Yep, so in this, if you don't have any chicken stock like we don't, so in this case, uh, what we have replaced it is we have pork water and also a tablespoon of oyster sauce and also soy sauce. So that will act as a stock flavouring for the rice. And then we'll put the slice of ginger on top of the rice. This is depending on your liking as well, so we like ginger, so we're gonna put more. Otherwise, you can just put probably half a cup. Yes, and also some mushroom. Yep. And uh, for the mushroom, probably you can leave like a half or a quarter. Uh, that is to put after the chicken, so that it will look nice uh, later on after you cook. Okay, so now that is done. What's the next step, yeah? Ooh, next step. You need to put the chicken in, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so yeah, this is how it looks like. Wow. Wow. So this is after marination of uh, about 30 minutes. And uh, yeah, we forgot on the uh, previous marination guide. Uh, we actually uh, need to add in about one teaspoon of sugar as well. So that is after adding the sugar. We just try to gently place it on top of the rice. It's done. Now we just need to cook it on the rice cooker. Guys, it 
is ready. Yes. Let's check it out. Wow. Smells good, huh? Mmm. So yeah, uh, after all is cooked, you can see all the rice is cooked. Uh, next, we're gonna pour in the sauce. Basically, this is just um, soy sauce. One tablespoon of soy sauce and also one tablespoon of duck sauce. That is just for the uh, appearance of the rice later on. So we just pour that in. And we'll give it a good mix. That is all done. Let's garnish it. Put some tomatoes. Can you smell it? Yes, it's so fragrant. I think the oyster sauce makes it so nice. Finally, with some parsley. And this is how you do it. Ooh, yummy. So this is it. Yes, the final product. It looks and smells passable. Mm. Yeah, passable too. <laughs> New word. Yeah, it looks good like, actually. And it, it smells, smells very so fragrant. No? And also the soup, just nice after boiling and uh, waiting for the rice to cook. The soup cool down just nice. Yeah. It's not too hot. Mm. So what do you think about making this rice? I think this is quite simple to make and mm. if you are having a busy schedule, this is totally good to go. Yep, yep. It's very healthy as well, right? Yeah. Just chuck everything into the yes. rice cooker and cook. And it's fun good. making it. <laughs> Yes, it's, it's quite fun making it as well. Uh, definitely, you can't get the clay pot taste. La, but then it hopefully, looks nice. Mm, hopefully, it turns out we'll be fine. Yeah. So, shall we? Let's try it. Cut to the chase. Are you really? ready? Smells good. Yeah. Mm. Seriously, no joke. Very good. Can't believe there's no Ajino Moto, no MSG. Mm. I, I, I really like it. Uh. Yes, it's healthy and it's good. And you know what? I just think of it. For lazy people like us, the best thing is right now, since we cook quite a lot, we can actually save it up for tomorrow as well. Yeah. So, plus fun for lazy people like us. Mm. <laughs> mm. It really satisfies our craving. Yes. <laughs> it's been so long since we have gone out to eat. <laughs> yeah. Let's try the soup though. Mm. Mm. Can really taste the sweetness of all the yeah. veggies, especially the corn. Oh yeah, the last time we put a little too much pepper yes. It turns out to be very spicy This, this time, is good. yeah, just a spoon of pepper mm. Not bad, not bad Passable lah, I mean like if you're not going out And you wanna, you're craving for pepper chicken rice Very simple before we end this video, yes. we would like to shout out again. Hope you guys are doing fine right now, healthy, strong. Again, we will get through this. Things will be looking better sooner. And stay home. Stay home. Make watch us. Clay pot chicken rice. Stay home. Watch us. <laughs> <laughs> stay home. Watch us make clay pot chicken rice. That's the three things you have to do. Three basic needs. <laughs> so, so, if you like our video, please like, comment, subscribe us. Hit the bell. Yes, and watch our previous and future video coming up also. Yes, so. Till next time. Ciao. See you. 
Okay. <laughs>